What's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Resident Evil. Uh, before we get started here, I was just going to bring up that uh, if you wouldn't mind going on and hitting that subscribe button down below, that'll actually, that'll help me out a lot and I would really appreciate it. I mean, I noticed that at least, I don't know, it was so many percent of the people who watch my videos aren't subscribed and I've just figured I'd bring it up. But yeah, feel free to go on and hit that button and... I need to figure out where I'm going because I do not remember. Okay. So while I'm at that item box, I guess I'm going to go on and drop off that fuel canteen. And maybe, I mean, I guess the lighter too, even though, I mean, they do come in handy. Thought I heard somebody. Or something. But yeah, it's been a little bit since I played this. Last time I played this, I didn't have this hair right here. So, there's that. A little bit of new stuff. Like, I get turned around on this game so much, I've noticed. <clears throat> like, I still, I don't really have that much of a memory of the map yet. Or the layout where I'm going or what goes where. See, I've already got to look again. Okay, it's not straight ahead, I know that. But which one of these? Don't know. Take these stairs, go or, yeah, go to the stairs and it'll be right there, but I don't remember where that... Oh! Make it open doors? I've never had one open a door. Go on and burn him up. Yeah, I've, ne I've never had one open a door like that. This is the storeroom and medicine room, I believe. Yes. Yes. Alright, now will it show me where he's at again? Uh... I don't know what I said of for, I didn't have anything to say yet. But yeah, I believe this this should be part four. And I don't know, I'm I'm into it. Does that take me around? I've been in this door, ain't I? Yeah. I think that Oh, oh, oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Whoa! I can't let you on fire, I'm sorry. I don't have any healing things either. I got the first aid spray in the lockbox and I... <clears throat> I need herbs. I need some herbs! I'm, now, I don't know if there's ever any zombies here in this main lobby. I could be wrong. 
Was he up or down? See, this is bad because, yeah, if I died, then I didn't save it when I was last there, and I don't know why I didn't. I got plenty of ink, 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 uh, blah, blah. I always call them ink wells, but they're actually ink ribbons, yeah. I think I can open that door now. But I'm not going to yet until I make it back to him. I'm sorry, I know this constantly opened up the map and inventory is probably a little bit annoying, but... Well, see, uh, yeah, I got that music, but I think there's somewhere with a piano, and it was missing pages, too. Okay, I was going to say, I thought there was a button just for the map. I'm not going to open any more doors just because I know he was in a route or somewhere that I had already opened the door. So if I open more. Okay, not here. Then it's got, he's got to be downstairs somewhere. All I know is, yeah, I can't afford to be attacked again. I think I got one more that I can handle. When it goes to caution, because there's danger. Alright, so, stairs it is. La -de -de -da, -de -de da Oh, it broke. Oh, what was that? Was that a note? Yeah, and you know when you're in a safe room, because you got that nice calming music. Wait, ain't, ain't Barry the guy that we haven't found? Yeah, I thought he was. I thought he was the one that we didn't know where he was at. Okay, but yeah, he left a note. He's the one that left stuff in there. I knew I hadn't seen that note before. This is where dogs jumped in. Hopefully no more happened. I mean, I, I got health now, and I do have one defensive item. Well, that was convenient. He was blocked in. No way he's dead. I think you can tell if, like, blood splatters out of him or runs out of him. Which I'm not seeing any. Double tap. <laughs> Better safe than sorry. I don't like those tight views right when you walk out of a door. Especially that. Oh 
okay, I'm running out of spots where he could be. Oh, 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 God! Oh my god! Ah, got you, motherfucker. Four of them came running through. Well, luckily not running. I saw I caught a glimpse of that guy here at the window. That was some spooky stuff. But yeah, it's like the game, it develops and gets a little bit harder each like step forward you make in the story-wise. He's gotta be either outside, which I don't think he is, or back in that one room that Leads nowhere. I guess we'll see. No, he's not here because that's where I got the shotgun. He's not in here. Maybe he's outside. I think where I got the grenade launcher. I don't remember if he gave me the grenade launcher. I don't think he did. It's not that one. No, it's not. I don't really like going outside. There's more chances of dogs outside. That guy's on this side of the building somewhere. Because I remember when I found him where the antidote was, it was across the building, or mansion. We'll get there. We'll get there. We'll save this guy. But yeah, he got attacked by what I, I don't... I don't... I think I said at one point I knew what something was going to happen, and it was to do with the giant snake. So, yeah, I mean... There's a giant snake, and I'm, I'm sure he'll tell me where it's at. Where was he? I mean, there's that one first room that kind of loops around, but... Oh, God. <laughs> that view... Face plant into a door. Any of you all gonna jump out and get me again? Please don't. I would prefer you didn't. No, it's not here. This just leads to that one storage area. Yeah, he's not here. Where did this guy go?
I'm starting to question myself, like if he was even on that side of the building, but I know he was. I know he was. Hold up. I didn't go in that red room. I forgot. I mean, just because it's red, it's unlocked, it's been open. I've went in that room. The red just means you haven't found everything in it. We might be getting somewhere now. Oh yeah, that was... See, I think this is where I got the grenade launcher. Is this where he was? I picked up the grenade launcher right there. There's some plants that I don't actually need at the moment. <clears throat> I gotta save before I go attack him at, or try to kill a snake. Chances are I will die the first time around. Was it this room? Yes. Okay, where yet? I don't remember what guy it is. I think it's the Chris this way guy. Oh, that's him. Is he dead? He's dead. I did all that for nothing. You just go and die on me. You're a jerk. Are you gonna come back to life? Richard. Just in case. Okay, so I'm assuming... I thought I heard a door. I'm assuming... Snake is through there. Okay. I haven't ran into that other guy for a little bit. The one that was helping me out in the beginning. So I'm going to the dining room anyway to save. Maybe now that I've realized Richard's dead, we have a dead comrade. I'll run into one of them again. I can update him like, hey, Richard's dead. He said there was a big snake. La -di -di -da. I'd love to live in a big mansion like this. I mean, they can keep the zombies. I know, yeah, in that one downstairs area over there behind the staircase, I remember I walked to the door and you like hear howling. Oh, thought I heard steps. I think it was just my last delayed step. Oh yeah, and it says I haven't discovered everything in this room yet. It's, it has to do with that, uh, <clears throat> that clock over there. I'm certain. But I don't I don't know what to do with it. I'm smarticles. When the two have run each other through the path, your destiny will open. I feel like it's either got to do with this picture or that thing. I thought they kind of I thought it had to, they had to do it to each other. The two have ran each other through. Like those guys, I mean, if you take it literal, they've ran each other through with a sword. Is this pointing me somewhere? The one sword's pointing up to the left, the other one's pointing just right. I didn't want to go through the door.
felt kind of weird calling like it's an episode just because I mean it basically it is <clears throat> I don't know it just felt weird but yeah oh yeah y'all let me know what you think about this hair too and by the time this video is up the video with glam and gaming would have been up too so you can see how it was all done obviously if you haven't already but yeah i mean uh i really like this color only thing is the dye yeah it's just it's one of those it's like washable or washes out pretty quick so it's gonna continuously fade every time i shower and wash my hair so i'm debating on doing it with a more permanent dye but they don't have this kind of color in those. Oh! Got me talking. No! Get down! I was talking. But, what I was saying is, yeah, they only have like darker blues. There's like a metallic blue, which I think would be the one I'd go for. I'm gonna go on and equip that. I feel like the snake is through this door. If it is. Okay, maybe not. There's a zombie coming though. Don't know from where. locked door right there which I might be able to unlock and an unlocked door down at the end okay that's just webbing like I feel at this point at any point over here I'm going to open the door with the snake in it I mean, this feels like a kind of a safe room. Magazine. Yeah. It's, she said it's too dark. I mean, I don't see a fireplace, but I put down the lighter anyway. It's too dark to see much of anything, but yet. You found that magazine. See that little gap right there between those rooms? That, yeah, and it's flashing red. Oh! Get off! At least you're a slow one. Are you caught? Stupid zombie. You dead? Are you dead? Okay. And what else is in this room? I, it ain't letting me pick anything up right there, and it looked like something's right there. I feel like I'm gonna have to come back here with a lighter. But there's no fireplace. The chandelier. Candles. I need the lighter. Go figure. Uh, see, I hate leaving rooms 
not all the way explored. Because what what's in this room that could help me is like what I get at. I'll see if I can unlock that stairs. The stairs. If I can't, then I guess I'll go back for a lighter. Huh. I think that's the room with the spider or spider snake. Okay, item of a shield. Okay. I don't have that key yet. But I think that's I think that's the room. Alright, we've killed a few zombies. We ain't done much else. Killed a few zombies, lost a friend. I'm still fine, yeah. We lost a friend. Ayo! Barry! Where you at, Barry? Got any other goods for me? I could have went the other way. Can I unlock that? I don't know if I've tried to unlock that room yet. Helmet, okay. Well, I got a journey just to get back to my items. By the time I make it over there, that might be it for this video. Yeah, and also feel free to uh, leave any other games you like, like recommendations I'll always take. I'm trying to open my, I can't think of the right word, but I'm trying to play a bigger variety of games, but I always have a time deciding which ones. Oh, you're, s oh, I didn't burn you. He won't be getting back up. See, that's why that other one disappeared. His head was off. So but all these corpses that are laying around have the potential to come back. But I like it when you pop those heads. Popping heads. Oh yeah, another thing I want to do. When, uh... Another thing I want to do when I get to the item chest is that uh, plaque that's kind of got a little, what looks like a shield on it. I want to inspect it a little more. Because yeah, like in that last, I think the last video, is when I realized I turned that wood plank, you have to look at it at a certain angle and then examine. So that's actually kind of cool though. You actually have to rotate and look around on items. It's, you can't just hit a button and it tell you something. So I want to see if there's any hidden thing on it to do with like a key, like a shield key. May as well. I'm, I think I'm about to run this out of kerosene, though. See, so I feel like the more they got up, the bigger chance I'd have of blowing their heads off. Then they wouldn't get back up anyway. Alright. I got my lighter. Oh, that's... I'm gonna go... I'm gonna put that back up. 
and then I'm going to, I guess I'll start making my way back over there, but that's actually going to do it for this episode though. I'm trying to keep these around the 40 minute range. I feel like that's a decent time. If any of you all have like a time frame that you prefer watching videos, then let me know because that's, that's something I don't, I don't really know. Like I tend to like watching longer videos, but I don't know about anybody else. And I understand not everybody wants to get on YouTube and watch an hour long video. I understand. But yeah, so that's gonna do it. Uh, yeah, like I mentioned in the beginning, subscribe. I would appreciate that a lot. Uh, like the video if you like it. If not, then don't worry about it. And yeah, feel free to comment, let me know what you think. But until the next video, I'll see ya.